guys it's lexi welcome back to my channel if you're a new subscriber here thank you for watching and if you're a returning subscriber thank you for supporting so as you can see by the title of this video this is gonna be a christmas wish list for 2022 i never did one of these videos but i seen that like you know a lot of girlies do it and y'all like it so i was like why not give it a try um just a disclaimer though it was really hard to come up with this list because honestly i don't know why but like this christmas it's nothing like specific like i really wanted or something that like i'm fiending for so a lot of these things is like just stuff that i want but i'm not like being for like oh no i need it for christmas but these are just some things if i were to have a wish list and get everything i want these are some of the things i would want so i don't know why it's just me or like y'all just don't know what you want i really don't know what i want i feel like a lot of times throughout the year i just be buying the things i want so when it comes towards like december it's like damn I done bought half the things I already wanted, so I don't really want nothing. <laughs> so that, that's what it'd be like to me. But anyways, I made it, uh, the whole list, I did 20 on my iPad. So, for the first one, I want the Burberry Hair Perfume. Y'all, when I smelled this perfume, I think it was around last Christmas. Yeah, I think it was around last Christmas, which is a long time. Um, that I had smelled the perfume. I'm like, oh no, like this is fire. Like even my boyfriend was like, no, you have to buy that. I don't know why I didn't buy it. I think it's because I was Christmas shopping for other people. So I was like, nah, like I'm gonna get that another time. And then I just never went and got it. But I really do want that perfume. I heard that I heard really good things about it. I mean, it smells mad good. I smelled it in the store, so I definitely want that. Then I went the Baccarat Rouge 540. I feel like all the it girlies got Baccarat and like babes why, why why i don't have it you understand so i feel like no i need that kind of her even my mom she always be telling me like no that perfume that perfume is it all right next is a pink ipad y'all y'all already know y'all already know you already seen the internet has a tiktok girlies hosting on a pink ipad i don't blame them right now i don't what I, uh, What's the iPad generation before like the pink, the color iPads came out, the pink and the yellow and all that? Whatever generation that is, this is the iPad that I have. So I basically had like the second newest iPad. So I just wanted the pink iPad just because the aesthetic of it. But y'all didn't tell me there was a yellow one. I actually like the yellow. Like I don't know why because like even like when the XRs came out, I had the yellow one. And not, you know, how much people had. They had, like, the pinkish coral one or whatever. But I'm like, I like the yellow iPad. Why right? nobody talking about it? I don't know. It's just, like, a perfect, like, vibrant yellow. Something about yellow. Just do it for me. You understand? So I'm like, I like the yellow one, too. The yellow one's not bad. I don't know why I don't see no one talk about it. If you agree with me, let me know. But I feel like the yellow one is cute, too. And I just found out... <laughs> I think I'm running late to this. But you can trade in any Apple product. So yeah, if you have an iPad, like me, I got this iPad. I could go into the Apple store and trade it in for the pink iPad. And all I had to pay, instead of I trading this for 256 gigabytes and just Wi-Fi for the pink iPad, um, it would just be 445 like trade in. So all I had to pay left is ain't going 50. So check it out. If you want to see how much it costs, remember it depends on the generation iPad you have, the condition, all that. So if you want to know, I would say go on the Apple website, put in the information, and it'll tell you how much you your trading will cost and all that. So I'm definitely doing that. All right, next is a 13-inch MacBook Pro. I have the MacBook Air right now. I like how small and compact the 13 inch the pro one is and i just feel like you know i need an updated macbook because sometimes mine be lagging a little and i don't like that i don't like that so and i'm gonna see how much my trading is for that too so i'm gonna check that out next i want the Louis Vuitton never full bag i feel like this is an og this is a classic like all the bad biddies got it so it's like why don't i got it i don't i got it so yeah i think i want the well i'm not even showing y'all <laughs> oh my god i'm so bad at this i'm so bad at this i'm not even showing y'all what i'm talking about i mean so far okay damn i'm not even showing y'all 
All right, let me show you how the bag. I think the, the first stuff I listed, I kind of know what it looked like. If you don't, just search it up. I'm sorry. I'm supposed to be showing y'all I'm done. All right, yeah, so this is the Never Full bag. I want, I mainly I want this color. But I was also thinking about this one because, you know, I feel like the lighter color one could get dirty faster. But I really like how that looks. So it just depends. That's just how it looks, though. I really want the light colored one. I feel like all, all the bad beauty's got it, so I need it. Then next is the medium or tall or black sunburst Uggs. I'm going to show y'all. These are like their new ones. You can't see the fur because it's all black, but it's fur down the side. Like, you know, like, the, you know, like the classic one, like these ones. It's just all black. This is cute, too. It's cute, too. But they got the medium one, which I'm going to show y'all. This is new. So I'm like, hmm. I have the medium, medium or tall. It really don't matter. They both look cute to me, but I like the all black. If I, yeah, so either one is cute. And the gray one is cute, too. But I mainly like the all black. Next, I want a navy blue um, moose knuckle coat. I already have the Canada Goose coat, and I really love the goose. Like, yeah, it just keeps you so warm. I just love it. But, unfortunately, one, um, they're not selling the coats with the fur anymore. And it's like, what's the point? What's the point? Because their fur is really mad nice. So, it's like, that's what a lot of people bought it for. So, the fact that they're not even doing that is like, okay. Whatever. And then, two, it's like, why would I buy two of the same coat? You understand? So, I feel like next in line would be the Moose Knuckle. I really like how they're, the style of it. I feel like it's just very New York. I know how to describe it, but Moose Knuckle just gives me New York vibes. And I, look, I feel like it looks so cute on girls. So I want this one. I don't know if you can tell. It's navy blue with the white fur. Or, I'm saying or, like, girl. What's it called? They have one with a gray fur. But yeah, I really want a Moose Knuckle, specifically a navy blue one. I've seen the girlies. It's a light pink one, but I'm like, it's cute, don't get me wrong, but I'm like, to walk around with a pink coat all day, mm. Mm. and then I feel like light colors, like I said, they get dirty faster, so I just want something nice and calm, so I feel like the navy blue is perfect. Next, our Bath and Body Work candles, I don't gotta show you how that look, because y'all already know how I look, and I feel like I'm really getting old, y'all, because the fact that I'm asking for candles for Christmas, it's like, mm. like before... I didn't really care for candles. One, because I just feel like, all right, you light it and then it stays lit or whatever. And then, like, it goes to waste because damn near half of it is already done. So it was like, the hell, what did I light it for? But then it's like, no. I see what the hype is about. And I need it all. All. Okay. Now, but for real, like, I don't know. Candles just make me hype. They just make me hype. But next, something else that's like kind of like old lady ish. Something like this. This is a small vacuum because yeah, I have a carpet in my room, right? And even though I don't do hair, some way, somehow, I always end up doing hair. And it'd be so much hair on a carpet. And it feels like no matter how much I sweep my damn carpet, it just looks always like it's just hair on it still. And I hate that. And it's like. Me, one, I don't like sleeping for long. It just makes my back hurt and all that. And I'm like, if I could have a nice vacuum where I could just, not even just vacuum my carpet, but also vacuum my room floor, I would love that. Like, I don't think I understand. Like, I don't know. Something about my room I take pride in a lot. And I just hate when my carpet feels like I gotta sweep it, I gotta sweep it three, four more times to make it look clean. You understand? So, I really want a small vacuum. I don't care as long as we're good. I don't care where you get it from. Next, I want moon boots. I said any color. I don't have a specific color. I just want moon boots. Y'all, I have this idea, right? I'm saying ideas, but nobody else did it. But I really, let me show you what moon boots is first. Just these, you know, moon boots. I feel like everybody knows, should know what this is. But yeah, just regular moon boots. I don't care the color because, y'all, I'm telling you, what I want to do is, hold on, the leave out is leaving. The leave out is leaving. All right. 
what I want to do is I want to like go on like a cabin trip or like you no know, my cousins and friends and stuff and I want us all to have different colored moon boots and take pictures in the snow I don't know why I just told you that I want no one stealing my idea but y'all tell me that's not gonna be fire like I feel like if we all had different colored moon boots we all stand in the line in the snow with our little ski goggles and ski outfit you come on now like I, I know it's gonna be fire I know it's gonna be fire and I just love how moon boots look like anything looking like platformish or whatever I just love it anything different I just love so I definitely want some moon boots all right, next is an apple pen. I think I know. I mean, I'm gonna search it up. But. Apple pen. Um, honestly, I could go get it right now on my own if I wanted to, but it's like, why if someone else could get it? And it's like, I don't know, like, apple pens, don't get me wrong. Like, I get the convenience of it and it's cute and all, you know, looking look like you're writing on your tablet and whatnot. But honestly, I know me. And the same way how my Apple Watch is just sitting in my drawer. I have not touched it once. I feel like that's how it is gonna be with the apple pen. So I'm like, why why would I waste my money on something I know I'm probably not gonna use that much when someone else can waste their money for me? You feel me? So yeah. Yeah, but I, I but don't get me wrong, I do like the idea of the apple pen and the aesthetic of it. So you know whoever wanna buy me it. Thank you. Next I want a full length mirror. I'm going to show y'all, like, I, I don't know exactly what kind. I just want a really big, tall, full-length mirror, y'all. Because I'm trying to, like, I want to say I'm doing over my room. Like, I'm not painting it over or whatnot. But I do want to add, like, new stuff to it and just upgrade it. You know, I feel like you should always upgrade your room because why not? So, I want, like, a mirror, like, because, like, I always want to take, like, you know, cute full-body pics that sometimes taking full body pics on your own without the mirror it just don't be coming all right so i want to take some cute ones in the mirror but i don't have a big tall mirror so i'm like no i really want like a big tall mirror where i just take cute pics in and just look cute in <laughs> but i really do want that for my room I'm trying to up and next are i just said fenty beauty products y'all i don't have any specific i just like anything fenty beauty i love like one i love their matte foundation y'all i think when did i buy it I probably bought their foundation like the matte one like probably two years ago and it still lasts me this long. Yep. And please don't call my car with the expiringness. I'm not hearing it. I'm not hearing it. Okay. My makeup expires when it's done. Thank you. So yeah. And I love like that foundation just gives me a flawless beat every time. I like it way more than the hydrating one she got. The matte one, it just does it for me every time. So I want that. I want any of her um Fenty bomb glosses because like come on now. do I really have to explain that do I really have to explain that like I love her lip glosses like Fenty Beauty um body butter the 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 limited is it limited edition is it let me know I don't know but the new one I forgot the name of it but you know the one that smells like cinnamon the people say and stuff I want that one the new one because my um friend she got it and I smelled it oh my god y'all it really do smell like cinnamon like that. <laughs> Alright. Next is a new bed frame. Like I said, I want to upgrade my room. So, like, you know, like the quilted bed frame kind of look, whatever. The bottom part, it can be, it don't have to be that specifically. That's cute though. I really like that. But it don't have to be that kind of one specifically. I just really want that quilted bed frame look. I just feel like I need a new bed frame. Next is the Saint Laurent medium, um, Shoulder bag, I'm gonna show y'all. I don't know, this just gives me like, I'm hurt, okay? Like, Miss Bougie, all that. Like, that's that's what that bag gives me, and I, I just love it. Like, I feel like it would be the perfect kind of travel bags. And me, I'm a kind of a fan, I'm a fan mainly of like, you know, big bags, like tote bags and stuff, which is why I also like the Never Full bag too from Louis Vuitton. I don't know, like, I just want to travel in style, travel as. The bougiest, baddest of them all. Let me stop. But yeah, I really like that YSL bag. I just feel like it's classic and like, you gotta have it. Like, if you if you really hurt, you gotta have that. 
So next, I want any like essential hoodies and sweatsuits. If you don't know what essentials is, I'll show you. Yeah. My sister, she's the one who started buying them. And I'm like, what's the hype about this? But I see the freaking hype, y'all. I love essential. Nobody has any specific color that I want because all the colors is fire to me, honestly. So any of these, it'll match your like, sweatpants with it. But like me, I'm a person, when it comes to clothes, I feel like you don't have to spend mad money to have nice looking good clothes. You understand? Like, come on, you can budget and find a way. But certain things though, you're gonna have to spend. You're gonna have to spend. And essential hoodies is one of them. It's not that expensive, like 90. It's not that expensive, honestly. But it's definitely worth it. Like, yo, it, it's worth it. The quality, the material is very thick, keeps you very warm. The only thing is, though, if you do order these hoodies, please make sure that you order like two sizes down or something because they run big. Like, I buy the extra, extra small men's, and you would think. It's like a medium and man or something the way it look on me. But it's not too crazy big because the extra extra small. But still, it's still a little baggy. But yeah, because it runs big. So make sure y'all watch out for that. Alright, next is a Louis Vuitton beanie. At first, I wanted... This is before your whole scandal thing. I wanted the Balenciaga beanie that says Balenciaga all over it. The pink one. But you know, Balenciaga is done for now. So I'm like, the Louis Vuitton beanie was next in This is really cute. I wish they had one, like, kind of, like, would have matched the, like, the bag, the Neverfull one, the light one. Ugh. Babes, I will look so damn good. But yeah, I feel like the Louis Vuitton beanie is cute. It's cute. Next, I want a Canada Goose vest. Or a Montclair vest. I feel like the Montclair is more... I don't know, like I said, I really love Can the Goose, so I'm like, I want to Can the Goose best, and I feel like that will keep you mad warm too. But I'm gonna show y'all how the Can the Goose best look. Mainly the black one, I feel like. I need the color, I don't know. Mm. But yeah, that's how the best look. I like it. But I would say Montclair, because I feel like Montclair though. Like, their vest is just more New York to me, I guess you could say. I don't know, especially when girls wear it, I just feel like it's really cute on girls. Like, it just gives. You understand? Let me show y'all. Like, do you have a black puffer, even? Like, that's what it's giving. I don't know, but I really like how Montclair vests look on girls, especially too. I just feel like it just gives. It really does give, and I like it. So, either one of those, I like. Um, oh, this is the last one. I just want like a makeup and skincare organizer. Um, basically, I don't want the Alex draws. I don't know. I'm not really a fan of the Alex draws, actually, because I don't have no vanity for it. So it's like, what am I doing with this big draw in my room? I just want like an organizer, like a tall organizer. Let me see. I like how it's like double sided. So one side I put my makeup on, next side I put my skincare products on. Um. One, I took the vanity out of my room because the way I like re rearranged my room, I feel like a vanity would just make it look too, ugh, like too much going on. And me, I'm a minimalist. I hate when a room looks crowded. Like, yeah, my room is big, but I want to keep it looking spacious. I don't want to crowd it with mad stuff. Like, that's just, ugh, I hate that. So that's why I just keep like a makeup. I like organizing things for all my lotions and makeup products. And but it's two separate ones, and I feel like they look well they are literally totally different i just don't like how it goes to the room because i want everything to look in sync you know what i'm trying to say so i want one whole car where i can put everything in it so like skincare makeup lotion whatever so yeah i really want that i'm a very yeah i love organizing if i could organize all day i really would like ask anybody i love organizing but um that's it for my christmas list like i said i ain't go too crazy or anything specifically because at the time I bought I'm, I'm probably gonna buy half these stuff anyways later on in the year so like I said it's nothing crazy or whatever but um I hope you guys enjoy this video comment down below one or two things that you guys want for Christmas so I can know and um thank you guys for watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe and turn on your post notifications for every time I post y'all already know every Wednesday but school just finished for me you know we have a 
the month break for winter break. So watch out, cause it might be two videos a week instead. But yeah, thank you guys.